what's up, y'all? It's your boy Lakeem on the Bob Originator. Shout out to Urban Ground TV. Salute. I'm rocking with y'all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you don't know, it's the boy Illinois. You call me Illy on Urban Grind TV Booth Radio. Yeah, yeah. This your girl, Miss Breezy, and you're watching Urban Grind TV. Yo, it's your boy D Mula. Right now, you're rocking with Urban Grind TV. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, K Valentine, and right now, you're tuned in to Urban Grind TV Booth Radio. It's Twan Gabs. You are now watching. Urban Grind TV. What's going on with you? This is Jay Shield, CEO. You're now watching Urban Grind TV. Grind like you want. Yo, 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 this your boy, producer Johnny Yayo of Black Wealth Music Group. Just been sending a special shout out to Urban Grind TV. Definitely check them out. They're the voice of the street. Hey, it's your girl DJ Gemini Jones, and I want you to check out Urban Grind Lifestyle Magazine. What up, what up, what up? It's your big homie Fiend, Fiend for the money. Bump, bump. You're now tuning into Urban Grind TV. You dig? Yo, what's good, people? It's the pride of the East Side DJ MH Tuttle. We are live at Smokey Studios, and I'm this is Urban Grind TV, and I'm here with the homie Stevie G. What's good, Broski? What's going on with y'all, man? Thanks for having me. No doubt. So you you've been working your artist. You got your thing going on right now. Tell the people about your new project. I got a new project coming out called More Than Words Two. It's a little eleven song project. It's gonna have me, a couple more artists like local artists, my boy Cam Quinn, Merc G on it. It's the sequel to my first project, More Than Words. That That's out right now. That's on Spinrilla, live mixtapes, my mixtapes. This one finna drop sometime. Sometime in February, I'm dropping it on Tidal, Spotify, Apple Music, stuff like that. So More Than Words, where that title come from? More Than Words, that's pretty much reminding people that like, I'm really finna give it to y'all on this one. Like this, this ain't just rhymes, like, it's buzz behind this and it's a story behind it. Like me really telling my story on it. Like that's more than worth. That's how I came up with the first title. Like so this the sequel to that. Like it's still buzz on this and it's just my story continuing basically. Like had me coming up. So for the people who ain't heard it yet, what could they expect from the project? Um, me talking about my day to day struggles, like some homies that I done lost, new experiences, me traveling a little more, stuff like that. And, like my story though, like I'm speaking for the hunters. Chicago, like the South Side, and I'm trying to basically get y'all that through my words, like through, make y'all picture the hundreds, the South Side, just me get y'all that raw though, like the raw version of that, nothing but my words. So being an artist, like what's the hardest part you've dealt with so far? The the controversy, like being being tied into the next artist, like being in Chicago, like everybody think that everybody doing the same thing, like everything is drill music or everything is guns and this and like basically trying to make yourself stand out as an artist and have, coming up with your own sound and finding yourself as an artist like that's probably the hardest part like not not being so much compared to the next person basically standing out so what separates you from everybody else i got my own sound like and y'all like y'all really have to tune in to some of my music to hear that that i got my own sound like i'm not talking about the same thing it ain't it's just it's different like when you hear my music you really picture you picture everything that i'm saying like it's like i'm putting it putting it together in a, a book it's like a book you're gonna really visualize everything that i'm saying like i stand out though like you could check out some of my projects like i got stuff on youtube like my latest project is farm ringing that's my new video i just dropped that like two two weeks ago that's most that's hot though like check that out though you can really hear what i'm talking about on all my music so more than words too you said coming out uh, you worked with a few artists who you work with uh cam quinn merc g and the rest is just me it's a it's just that's the only artist that's on the project and more than words that was just a solo project with just me what about uh producers producer wise i'm working with Earthron. that's my that's my producer uh filthy rich who else it's some cash money, AP beats on there, like, but mainly 50 Rich and Earth Run. That's dope. For everybody who needs to be in tune with you, where can they find you at on social media? You can find me on Instagram, underscore Stevie G underscore. You can find me on Facebook at Steve G. 
uh, Twitter, G underscore Stevie underscore. DJ MH Twitter, Stevie G in the building, Urban Grind TV. We out. I'm Steve G, this Urban Grind TV. Make sure y'all check them out. Yo, y'all know what it is, man. It's your boy, Wow, live from Smokey Studios, Urban Grind TV. I got bro God in the building, boy Floyd. What's going down with you guys? Black, black. I'm good, I'm good, chilling, you know. What, what, what's happening with you right now? Man, I'm, I'm music, man. You know what I'm saying? Just uh, growing, growing in, in this music industry, you know what I'm saying? Just doing what I got to do, trying to bring my fans and everything the best music possible right now, you know? Okay. So now what you what you got? Cause last year you was pushing Never Change, yeah. was going crazy around the city and everywhere. What you got right now working on? See, see, this I got a lot of stuff to talk about like in this interview. You know what I'm saying? For the last like, uh, yeah, I've been in like a, a situation. You know what I'm saying? That's kind of like was hindering me from dropping music. You know what I'm saying? But my team, we 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 working hard. You know what I'm saying? To reach a conclusion in this matter. You know what I'm saying? But. We working it and we I got we got stuff coming on the way, you know what I'm saying? Right now I'm currently working on not for the faint of heart. But you know what I'm saying, we're gonna get the people what they need. Okay, bet that, bet that. We'll talk more about that on Urban Grand Radio. But uh sorry, so you got that mean you got a lot of music just in the stash then pretty yeah, much. Yeah, I got a lot of music like ready to go, you know what I'm saying? Okay. So now what's keeping you motivated? What's keeping you going right now with with, 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 with whatever thing you got going on? Just music in general, like music, like all my life has been like therapy for me. You know what I'm saying? Like I always tell people like, I can't define my music cause it defines me, you know what I'm saying? So I reached a point like where me and my music is one and, and I'm ready to get this new sound to the world, you know? Now, now I've been checking out a couple of your stage presences, some of your performances and stuff like that. What where, where, where that energy come from when you're doing that there? I mean, like I said, like some people, they get a little adrenaline rush like, do roller coasters and stuff. Me, I get a rush like just performing for people and 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 let people experience my talent. And I always was told like you go hard or go home. And I always leave my heart on the stage whenever I perform. You know, yeah. whether it's two people, three people, five hundred people, a thousand people, because it's something I love to do. You know. Okay. Now behind never changed because I don't. I, I didn't get a chance to interview you when when that dropped. What 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 was behind that? Cause like I say, I see that go crazy. The numbers was going up. What what was inspired behind that? See, never change. Never change is basically like I told you. Like I like to put myself in my music, my soul in my music, and it's basically about like anybody that you thought from your past, whether it was a relationship or anybody that thought like you wasn't gonna be nothing. You know what I'm saying? So. I, I, I try to, no matter where I turn people up, I try to have like motivation through my music. You know what I'm saying? To, to give people, it's basically like you started right here and you looked at these people like, oh, they, well, these people looked at you like, well, he not gonna be nothing, what he gonna, you know what I'm saying? And and you turn that, you you basically turn nothing to something, you know? Man. That's, hey, I like to hear that. So, I right, if people haven't checked out any of your music, what can they find of that right now that you got, whatever you got out right now? Well, my current project I got out right now is called For Better or Worse, and you can check that out on any platform. I got videos, some of the dopest videos, um, bringing some of the dopest energy. And um, like I said, you can find me at I Am Boy Floyd. That's basically all my social media, my Twitter, and that's I A M B O I F L O Y D. You know what I'm saying? You could you could Google me too. I Am Boy Floyd, and everything will pop up. You know. Well, it's your boy Wow. It's the boy Floyd. We here, Smokey Studios, Urban Grand TV, and we out. Fuck with your boy Floyd, and you're now watching Urban Grand TV. Let's get it. Scoop. Somebody tell me if you've seen her. Like Jamie Foxx and Willie B. Look at my wrist. Look at your, look at your, look at your wrist. Now look at your, look at your, look at your wrist. Talk about money, we don't give, we don't give. Who flying it is? You talk about dollars, we talk about cents. It doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense. Not giving a fuck about cars, you niggas are leasing and driving. Not giving a fuck about bitches who brag on the dragon, they riding. Not giving a fuck about rappers who mumble and people recite them. Yeah. Not giving a fuck about giving a fuck and I'm feeling excited. Uh, block and reload. These niggas are old, a nigga is bold. You shuffling, he playing his cards, tell him don't fold. Kill a man, kill a man, kill a man. Watch you bagging a hundred grand. Blickens I snitching on Instagram. Like witness, testify on the stand.
Hey, what's up guys? This is your boy Kevin Little on behalf of Martins International inviting you to escape to Jamaica to celebrate the Reggae 50. Celebrating 50 years of reggae at the 37th Annual International Reggae and World Music Awards, IRAMA. Yeah man, Saturday, May 11, 2019 at the Pegasus Hotel in Kingston, Jamaica. To become a sponsor or for other information, visit www.irama.com or call 877-9-REGGAE. Come celebrate in the sun and have fun in Irie, Jamaica. Going down so deeply A voice said to me Don't lose your face so quickly Hey, this is your girl, Samantha Moon, and I would like you to go check out my new EP called Samantha Moon Wake Up Now on all social media platforms. And don't forget, check out my website at samanthamoonmusic.com. You call me now. 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 When it's your turn, the table turn, and now you're underwater. Really sneaky looking in the mirror, in the mirror. Death to a hater. Party hard with a rub rat. Just tell me where the drugs at. Different pattern like a tight strap. Wrong or wrong, nigga, ride it right. Ten speed, no damn bike. Shake him up and roll the die. Tomorrow ain't even promise, right? Absolutely not. Back up in the spot where you stand. Yes, he paid for it. Yes, that he's the man. It's a strategy to pop, pop, got rubber band, man, man. Blow the spot. Yes, man, this is great. Ah. Oh. Well, this nigga looking in the mirror. In the mirror. Death to a hater. We don't hate. Not giving a fuck about cars, you niggas are leasing their driving. Not giving a fuck about bitches who brag on the dicks that they riding. Not giving a fuck about rappers who mumble and people recite them. Not giving a fuck about giving a fuck and I'm feeling excited. Uh, block and reload. These niggas are old, a nigga is bold. You shuffling hoes. He playing his cards, tell him don't fold. Kill a man, kill a man, kill a man. Watch you bagging a hundred grand. Niggas I snitching on Instagram. Like witness, testify on the stand. Call Blanco for the Blanco. I'm like OJ with the Bronco. Live a life every day with the honcho. Press the ball, my sis like Rondo. Never knew a cold nigga from Chicago. Young niggas on the move like Pronto. Main breeze, you can squeeze, bitch, swallow. This hollow, you swallow. My wrist. Look at your bitch. Look at your wrist. Now look at your bitch. Look at your wrist. Talk about money, we don't give a shit. Who flying it is? You talk about dollars, we talk about cents. It doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense. Look at my wrist. Look at your bitch. Look at your wrist. Now look at your bitch. Look at your wrist. Talk about money, we don't give a shit. Who flying it is? You talk about dollars, we talk about cents. It doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense. Uh. 
people, people don't dream. They sippin' the lean, sippin' the lean. She go for the team. She fuck everything, fuck everything. Low self esteem and buy everything, buy everything. Yeah. Now she a fiend. She lose everything, lose everything. See me rise on the tide, ultra spray anytime. Yeah. Chicago Bulls, White Sox, West Side, South Side. Solidify in the streets, military don't deny. Solidify black Jeep on the creek, spray the nine. Recognize a real one when you see one. Motherfuckers don't hate, try to be one. Overseas, son, for yeah. no reason. Everybody get money, what's your reason? Uh. Go home, so what's the point of leaving? Yeah. Outside yeah. yourself, you believe in. Uh. Will you succeed? You the reason. Yeah. I'm the yeah. reason. Yeah. I'm succeeding. Yeah, my wrist. Look at your bitch. Look at your wrist. Now look at your bitch. Look at your wrist. Talk about money, we don't give a shit. Who flying it is? You talk about dollars, we talk about cents. It doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense. Look at my wrist. Look at your bitch. Look at your wrist. Now look at your bitch. Look at your wrist. Talk about money, we don't give a shit. Who flying it is? You talk about dollars, we talk about cents. It doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense. Yeah. Scoop. Street ma. Lisha. Ah. Street ma. Lisha. DJMH to the Wild Smash Cash Radio, Rahima, the Dream Team in the building. We are back. We got a special guest in the building, y'all. What up? <laughs> y'all okay? You, pa- you did this. What's with these dramatic pauses, bro? Oh I want to make sure y'all on point with me. Y'all, ain't, y'all, like, y'all was thinking about something else, like, huh? No, what? we knew who we had in here. We I was know thinking G- about the comment our guest said about the mic looking like something else, and I was. That's what I thought it was. I kind of, my man went somewhere else. Y'all know I it don't take much. I didn't hear the comments, so, but I, was, I, 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 I could just imagine She said mad. It, it looks like a mic the way I grabbed the side, the shaft, and, you know. <laughs> oh, the names. Okay, so, so for all our <laughs> listeners who don't know, Armani K is in the building. Can we get a round of applause Let's for her? Let's go, okay. What's up, what's up? How are you? I'm great, how are you? I'm awesome. Welcome to Urban Ground Radio. Thanks for having me. No problem. So what's been up with you? Man, just been on my business, getting the paperwork together and everything so I can push this music even Wait, further. I, I like how you said that's the first okay. time I heard mm-hmm. artists say that up front. Mm-hmm. Yeah. They're like, yeah, no, I'm, oh, I'm, I'm out here. I'm rapping right now. you like, oh, I'm, no, I'm getting the paperwork <laughs> yeah. done. Yeah. Getting All that together that first, which is the smartest thing to do, though, when you're For doing sure. this. Because mm-hmm. you, you want to monetize off everything you're doing. Yeah. But um, now, first of all, I'm, I'm 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 liking the reservedness. But how you go back, L Spass? Okay. You sitting over here like, yes, hello, how you are stole you? Stole my I question. I leave that for the music and on the stage, you know. Okay, so, so. you got two sides. Of you. I feel that though. I feel that. I be like that sometimes. They call me wild, then you know I just be. Oh, calm. I see it. You, you crazy? <laughs> no wow. Oh, I see. It. He wild, wild all the time. Like, he wild versus wild. You know what? Like, oh, oh. Yeah. <laughs> I oh. tried to get a check for him, but they said because I'm not his guardian, so, <laughs> so you know. Yeah. Y'all trying to get checks on me. <laughs> yeah. If anything ever happened to me, y'all please keep this recording and know who to come for, y'all. That's all I'm saying. I Hello. would just like to say oh, I here. love your hair color. I love thank your makeup. You, thank you, thank you. You're just like a little chocolate mint up here. Just oh my God. okay. <laughs> wait, hold, wait, hold on. Thank it's you. time to be eaten. Though, like, so oh, just, hey, what are you saying? Suck on the chocolate until you get to the mint part. Okay, Big that. okay all oh, right. Wow. Welcome to Urban Ground Radio. Welcome to Urban Ground Radio. <laughs> <laughs> you did. So, how long you been rapping? <laughs> yeah. That's how you go to the next question. Right. Just like, I'm there right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lord. Well, um, I've been rapping professionally since 2013. Okay. Yeah. So professionally, so what does that mean? You was rapping? like, I was at first. I like was scared to let people hear me and like even put a song out there. So mm-hmm. putting a song actually out there was in 2013, like to the masses. So when did you know that this rap thing had you battle bootstraps? I thought you was gonna say something else. <laughs> <laughs> you, don't, you never no. know. You never know what. Huh? You never know. <laughs> oh my god. Um. 
It was way before that though Cause I used to just write You know what I'm saying Write mm-hmm. Without the beats And to like Over the industry beats of course you know, So wait hold on You was a poet then You tell me Nah you it, it wasn't even that I could just I would do songs With my best friends Like Write them Without the beat Cause we'll just be creating What we feel You know what I'm saying okay. And turn it into a song Cool. But never recording them and throwing them out. No, nah, because he wasn't he wasn't a single rapper, but he was dope at what he was doing. So we'll just create something. I still got them notebooks too. That's crazy. Uh, and I was like, what, twelve? Okay, so you really been putting in work. Yeah. Like, so what made you say, all right, twenty thirteen, this the year I'm finna record this and drop this? What made you like want to do that? Jump out the window and be like, I'm gone. Because I had already recorded. I was C. Dilla. Shout out to him. He had put me in the studio at like, what? 14, 15? Okay. I had already recorded and I was so shy then. Mm-hmm. So I'm like, let me try this by myself. Step out and do this differently or whatever the case may be. And it just went on from there. And each year I was just progressing and working on my craft. Getting better and better. Cool. So the sound I have now, I don't sound nothing like that then. But they still like that. Mm, so they still like the old style, but you 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 growing. Yeah, so they just gonna have to listen to the old. <laughs> now where you from in the city? Westside, two ninety. Oh, shout out to Westside. <laughs> so you an Uncle Raymond's lover, huh? Oh, hair was good. I ain't gonna count. Okay, okay, okay. Come, okay. On, come okay. on, come on. Give it a thousand okay. with us. Who's your birthday? April seventeenth. Okay, she almost. She was almost a Gemini. Almost. I do not want to be no Gemini. She was almost right. a Gemini. That's a, that's <laughs> a, that's a, wait, 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 hold on. Ain't you a Taurus or something? Or no, close to? No, I'm Aries. Uh, Aries. Yeah. Oh, one of them bullheaded or stubborn some, people, some right? Some respect on the <laughs> oh, Aries, okay? Oh, my bad. Shout out to Aries, though. <laughs> I, no, I'm just saying that's the animal they said, like yeah, the ram. Yeah, the ram. Of the ram, yeah. I got you. You said stubborn. That's, that's not an animal. <laughs> that's a characteristic of bullheaded. Like, or what? It's a bull. Like. Yeah, <laughs> My bad, I wasn't talking about you like that, fam. You know? Oh, my God. <laughs> so, all right, 2013. Yeah. All right, you dropped your first joint. What was it called? And, like, what was the reaction behind it when you first put it out? They they was rockable. It was just, um, I called them freestyles. So, it, it's different, though. But it was Love No Thotties by Chief Keith. And it was something else. That Future song, I forgot, though. But they was rocking with it. But I can't stand to listen to it to this day. Why? I don't bro. like my voice. I don't like. I never did. I never liked it my voice. I was like, I sound like a little girl in the water, man, But I don't like that sound. What got you out your shyness though? What made you say, you know what? It's time for me to put out some music, like for people to hear me for real. I wanted to change. I wanted to change my sound. Actually, I was uh, working with my engineer at the time, Gator, and I loved how he was sounding. So I just wanted the transition. I wanted to be a better artist. I'm like, it's mm. something. Something I'm missing. Like I always had it, mm-hmm. but it was something else I wanted to do. So okay. that's why I did it. I feel you on that because when I first started this whole radio recording thing, I would hear myself play back. I used to feel like I sounded like Kermit the Frog. So you ain't like your, you ain't like your yeah, voice. Like, yeah. What can what? I do? You know? Voices. What? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> My bad, y'all. I'm, just, I'm riding with y'all. All right. So look, anybody, I right, you come from out west. Who was some of your influences in hip hop that made you like, you know, because the female rappers, I know they always, you know, we always hear guys when we ask them, Joe, who you like? Then they always go, Wayne, you know, the certain generations say Wayne and all this, but who was, was you looking at that was like, as far as a female artist that was like, Joe, yeah, I could do it because she doing it. Then, up until now, yeah. just anybody? I mean, yeah, you, you rock with whatever it's by you. Oh I like the Missy, I like the Eve, and mm-hmm. yeah. things of that nature, but. What's crazy is Tink is who I really came that's to. That's dope. Mm. That's, him. Okay. that's who I came to. So. Big Dash, yeah. shout out Tank, man. Yeah. Need some of that mu- new music too. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like for real, it's real out here in the field. You, you pushing know? a new single, right? Yeah, wait on it. Talk about it. Go crazy. Um, that single dope. By the way, it is. Are you listening to it? Of course. Wait, hold on. Hold on. <laughs> wait. Okay, look. Let me let me do a quick disclaimer. When he gets music, whoever your manager may be, <laughs> shout out your manager. You're a team. But we need to get music over here because we have separate entities at times. And, you know, I like to listen to music, too. You know what I'm saying? Well, he I don't just want to be in the know when it. we get up here on this panel. Yeah, he don't give music until he break it like y'all heard four it. months. Y'all heard I know you done probably broke it like 13 times be, be, and, be, until we get that's it. That's fact, but we <laughs> opened up Bar for Bar with her song. We sure did. Yeah, she, she, she was on Breaking the Yankee last yeah. week too. Oh, oh, 
Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. See? Come on. <laughs> you say no to uh, whatever you uh, dealing with right now. Sometimes <laughs> tequila. <laughs> sometimes tequila. And sometimes other things. So you so got a visual go coming ahead. with it with your, with your uh, new single? Yeah, I, it got pushed back, though, um, due to some other stuff. So I got to drop a different visual before I even drop that, even though this song been pushed since, you know, for months now, but since July. But I got to drop something else before I drop weight on the visual. It's it's all strategic. Everything is strategic. Everything. Okay. Every move is the right one that I'm making. Hey, the fact that you came up here and said paperwork first. That's, oh, man. I'm just going off of everything you say. Like, yeah, <laughs> okay. Yeah, Burton Ernie did that. Like, mm -hmm. bam, I'm just taking whatever you say, and that's the guy. Right. Because <laughs> <laughs> you, you kicked it off the right way. Man. She said, Hashtag. Paperwork. Hashtag. Oh, my bad. Hashtag. <laughs> <laughs> they be trying to flood me up here if I don't say that, right? Let me make got sure to, I get that. The, hashtag the right way. You know what I'm saying? But all right, so now we got all this. Now wait, hold on. What was that joint we broke last week? I forgot the name of it. Um, Y'all got a different. Talk to me. Talk to me, nice. We broke, yeah, we what broke. It, we broke. Break it and yank it. We broke the song last week. We actually liked it. We say we rock with it. Broke it. Um, I can't remember the title of it. Though. I'm finna tell y'all. Keep talking. But like, yeah, that's, yeah you have. Up. You have bars though, like. Okay. Oh man! Yeah, no, I read yeah for ba for ba. I did like that song that they played because we was able to play it all the way through. Okay, and anybody Soul Scottish. That's the song we played last mm -hmm. week. Soul oh Scottish. my god! Oh lord! What? <laughs> what happened? Yeah, we broke that. What's up, Soul Scottish? What's happening with that? What, what, why you, I'm so, you know what? Y'all special though, because nobody has that, and that is unreleased. Wait, yeah. that's, that's unreleased. <laughs> What? Oh. Shout oh, out yeah. your management then. Banging. Dang it. I decided that. Okay. I decided to get it to y'all. Appreciate that. So, y'all yeah. was talking about that? Yeah, we, we broke that last though. week. What? We broke that. <laughs> we broke that. I feel sorry. Why? 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 Why you feel sorry? For when everybody else here. Okay. It was some bars. Wait, why is that? Wait, so I listened okay? to it. Put okay, us on game. Why you okay. got to put me in tune? Okay, wait. Because I'm before you say something, I'm, I ain't even going to lie. We were sitting here listening to this song, and I hear the intro of it. I'm like, that's that sounds familiar, right? And so then, you know, <laughs> as she started rapping, she oh, say a few lines, and I'm like, oh, wait, she talking about somebody I know. <laughs> oh, okay. And, and when it was over, I'm like, oh, oh, man, we just played man, that song. Man, man, man. That's that's why I said this feels so I remember this. Oh. So okay, so can you tell the people about the song? Okay, so do I really want to get into that? I don't know. Um, yeah, we go with the dramatic pauses. <laughs> All I heard was do do do. To 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 be a thousand though, you know, it's actually a disc record. So of course. Oh, so said, a shots fired type yeah, record. You know, but I did, my, you know, my way. So, I, I ain't duck nothing. It was like, you know, name said and all that. So, the so wait, the name was said in the joint too. Yeah, I ain't not I a full, not listen. a full name, a nickname. I gotta listen again, Send yeah. me that. Send me that. Send yeah. me that. Send me so that. Send me that. So why you why you waiting to release it? I'm ready to. I'm ready for the smoke. Look, you. <laughs> 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 again, everything is strategic. Okay. So, okay. Yeah. I'm telling you, the one thing, especially in this hip hop, when it comes to women, man, all of this back and forth stuff that be going on with the personal man. If you a rapper, put that stuff on wax. That's what we need to yeah, hear. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's True. what we now need to hear. Now it's this culture though, cause, 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 cause. I always have to be the person who like to play the devil's advocate. Mm -hmm. So y'all know when when you put out the this song, which I love them. I ain't never gonna lie and say I don't love. I love this tracks. But the energy that you put out behind it, because you know people getting their feelings. This ain't a day and age where people can take a diss track and be like, "I'm going Facts. back to the studio." They like, "No, I'm finna meet up with you. You don't talk about my kids like that. You don't talk about my mama or my dead dog. You know what I mean? Like, and I mean, but the part of a diss track is that's how you hit them. You talk about mm -hmm. their mama. You talk about their dead. No, it the does no, is kind of sort of. No, I said, but I mean. I feel a way about that. I mean, I understand. Even on the battle rap side, I know they do it all the time. Mm -hmm. And I be like, whoa, you know what I'm saying? When y'all draw the line. But. Ain't no line. It was a diss record first. So once I heard that, I'm like, okay, let's see how far you going to oh, go. Oh, you responded. Oh, you got dissed. But I was already prepared. I just never dropped it. 
So oh. you was like, wait, hold on. So you was like almost like um um uh, Eminem, Eminem and MGK. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. But I, I ain't drop it though. But I'm like, you know, I'm awake. Dig I'm awake. Yeah. I mean, strategic. I ain't bet that. You know, I, <laughs> so I got two more songs after that. <laughs> okay. So it's like, Ready it's, it's pretty much. So you say, so you part of, the, this is the part of the, of the B part that I like to talk about, right? Like, I. Right, so you under the, under the Drake act, like, look, I ain't even finna, I got like, enough for <laughs> you to put the heat out. Like, ain't no, you wait two days for a response, I got another one for you, like, like you already, so soon they respond. Or oh, dog, ain't that dog Q and, uh, what's the name, Tory oh, Lanez, Tory right? Lanez. Like, they go, even though. I don't even care for they beef, though. Even though, I'm, yeah, it just, it's. it's and to me, it's right. substance, though. It give it gives the music. Other than we ain't always talking about we got a million dollars and all this. Talk about somebody. I heard you mm-hmm. is a two minute person, and you came. <laughs> you know, you eat Wait, booty what? or something. Oh, what? Oh, this is a family what? show. Sir? Say that. Oh. This is a family Shout out Kevin show. Gates. No. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, God. I was just saying, you know, <laughs> I, I'm just thinking, I, you know, I, I don't put, you know, I don't participate in diss tracks, but, you know. I it's fun to hear people so rap. It's fun. That's what the battles is about. Hearing people rap, hearing people's skills yeah, get people put to the test. Day, but it's yeah. like, and creativity. Like, yeah. you, I like when you say something super slick and you, you talking about something like, yo, wait, I ain't, I wasn't ready for that. Mm-hmm. Oh, rewind that. Play that. Do they rewind again? It's still rewind, right? Like, <laughs> Go back on that. My bad. Oh <laughs> so what else is uh what's, what else is going on for you in 2019? <sighs> More visuals. Like I'm gonna stay away from the performance side. I'm probably here and there, but not as much as I was. Like I've kept. So I'm just gonna push my visuals. Now I, I hear artists say that though. Why why do y'all pull back from perform or is it just performing in the I'm city? A, I'ma speak on me personally because yeah. I see too many artists. They perform in the same spots and ain't nobody there to really put them on and do nothing. Mm. I believe in myself too much to continue to go in the circle. I watch people go in that circle. Mm. So it's like I know where I need to go to. I know my lane and I know where I need to get to. Okay. So I'm not gonna Basically, make the mistakes they make. Uh, okay. I like how you watch so, yeah. it. Watch That's it and dope. learn it. I like, I like you as an artist, though, because I feel like you real dope and versatile. Like, you rap, but you sing, too. Exactly. Like, how long you been singing? Like, of course, Wait, you sing, too, life. Joe? Yeah. She just was going to slip on stage wait, and not you, even tell us. Wait, you sing, too, Joe? Yeah. So you really you said a, Tink is our inspiration. I know. That, you bro, know? why y'all trying to act like I'm... I'm just like, saying, if you... <laughs> <sighs> We go, if we go. That, dramatic yeah. pause. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> there we go now. <laughs> so you got. So wait, are you like one of them? Um, uh, what they call it, auto tune singers, or is you like you really can? Uh, I don't know what that last part was, but <laughs> she gonna auto tune that for me though. Like, no, I don't know what that last part was. So you, you can really you got I mean like I so, sing, you know? so I, was you were you one of them choir sing, people though like you came from the choir uh, or like, I sure was finna say church choir sing no, or just I play around like that though okay. a lot of the times but I harmonize so now okay melodic I'm a melodic because I be I, I I like it like so so damn so now you gotta be asking how you approach your music now like when you in the studio what's the session with you like like. I pull up, you call Wow. Wow, I'll come to the studio. <laughs> I ain't going to bring all the thotties with me, but I'm. you going to have thotties there for me? Oh, or, my, oh my God. Or no, friends. Wait, my bad. Mercy. Not thotties, friends. I don't like that. I don't like a lot of people in my no. session. So Double just you. people, that's cool. I, let, I mean, unless we getting lit, but just be quiet while I'm working. Like, mm-hmm. don't. You know what I'm saying? So let you burn work. incense and you got lights out and stuff like that. No. Oh. <laughs> no. I thought you were one of them chances. <laughs> I'm going to be in that. Sage is better to burn you know, than incense. Sage, not incense. Somebody burns. Only somebody from 1968. <laughs> ah, ah, incense. Don't be strong. Don't be strong. You walk in and get your throat. Don't you ain't not all pimp. Can I get some water? You got incense burning? And he got a he got a uh, what is that? A panther looking thing? <laughs> cheetah cheetah rug in there. Like. <laughs> Sit down, Sit down, boy. Sit down, boy. So, all right, so we got, so all right, you you approached, like, because I, I heard you earlier saying you used to write without beats. So do you still do that now or, like? No, and do you, I, I, I go find me a beat now, like, and just vibe to it. A lot of the times it's something I'm either going through or it's something somebody else going through. I just, 
I may relate to music. That's why both genders can rock with it, period. Mm. Now, you got any special producers that you work that you like always go to? Like, Joe, I know you got something for me. Like, my boy Flamin. Flamin' the producer, he down there in Houston. Shout out to him. Shout out H-Town. I love H-Town. Gotta pull up mm-hmm. again real soon. Let's get it. So it- are you as aggressive on singing as you are when you rap? Hmm. <laughs> Lyric-wise, yeah. Okay. The stuff I talk about, the content. Okay. So which one you? Oh my bad, bro. So what's to the um, Armani K versus Spaz? Like, I know we touched on it a little bit earlier. Like, do we get Spaz more than we get Armani K, or we get Armani K more than we get it's Spaz? It's a mixture. It's okay. like yeah, it's a mixture. So Spaz is the rapper side of me, you know, like you said, the aggressive, and Armani K is the singer, the soft side. So I combine both of them all the time. I dig it. So which one is easier? That's what I wanted to ask. Which one is easier to do? Is it easier to write this, the the song, or is it easier to write them bars? Like, depending on my mood, it's easier to write a song though, cause it just flows out. But you know, I instantly if I start singing, then I could just rap right after it. So I kind of say both, but it's easy to sing though. Okay. okay she can rap yeah. her verse and sing her own hook. Yeah. Dig that. Damn, you get all. That's why she getting that paperwork right. Oh, God. Like, Y'all ain't gonna not pay me. I did that. I did that too. I did all them points. Like, I did it, yeah. I you, like, you got a song where you talked about your child? Yeah, for my son. That song is so dope. It's yeah. like, man, mainstream right there. For your dope. son, Joe? You okay. gotta hear that. Okay. No, 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 no. I, I see I how like I be that. listening. I like, I see I like how I be that. in tune with all the people who got you who, who out here. Bro, doing they listen. Thing. I'm going to say this. For everybody who listens, out here coming to hate. It ain't hate. I, I don't like how you always say you in tune <laughs> when you hold in the emails with all the dang old music. <laughs> That's my job. We would be in tune too. Listen, if we, it, I'm saying if you're well, hello. Let me just ask Radio Right. He must. If he wanted to have an edge of us, right. that's what it is. Looking. He like. And you see how he smiled when yes, he said edge. I, I, I want to like, have so an edge of you, I heard you talk about the Listen. family coming over for Thanksgiving <laughs> on that <laughs> other song. Every 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 radio host, every DJ. I'm breaking the records. You get it afterwards. And that's yeah. like months down the line. Exactly. Right? Like, so you were talking about your <laughs> you cousin Tina. You're going to have a call me. You you're like, okay, you're going to have on. to wait. Dude. But that, that ain't like, it's just. I mean, it's out there, though. Like, it's on all the platforms. You definitely go check it out. See, that's that's for me to listen to. <laughs> <laughs> let me, let me, let me, let me. I don't think she understand what I do. I love Urban Grand Radio. I, I, this is what I do. True. But I play music, too. Right. Like everywhere, so yeah, we need your music. So we can break it everywhere as well. I know what he's doing. I'm gonna send it to you, bro. Man, I right. promise, I'm gonna send then, it I'm to you. I'm gonna tell you just how he do. We don't. He'll flood me like once every nine months. So it's like I have a baby in my in my email. Like Joe, oh what? I can't even pull all this music down. Where's all this gonna go now? <laughs> you asked for it. You I said it. it. Like, bro, they broke that like nine months over. There. Well, you got it now. It's like, oh, <laughs> appreciate you, sir. Take it or leave it. Right. <laughs> Yo, what's an ideal track for you? Like, if you could have a track with anybody, any feature, any producer, who would you pick? Wait, don't say my name, because I already know. So, you anybody. Like anybody other than why? That'd be dope. Who? Ooh, Metro Boomin on the track? Mm-hmm. Now, what about feature, though? Like, you, like you, if you could get any feature right now that you know, like, look, I know we can. Not, not for the look, but for the song. Like, I know we can make some dope music together. How far are we going? As far as you he, want. He decides. I don't want to work with Drake. Andrew. I can see that. I can see that. Yeah. I can definitely I can see, see that. that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. He, and y'all go interchange one like one <laughs> one side of it. Y'all go bar for bar. Yeah. And y'all come back like, ooh, 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 ah. <laughs> oh, my bad. Please do not copyright that vocal oh right there. I, I got Copy it. Written. I got you. Look. <laughs> so what's some of your challenges that you face um, as a female rapper? <laughs> That's we a good question. Right now. I don't really That's a fact. No, no challenges. Shout out Cardi B. She so, put y'all on top, didn't she? No, like, <laughs> I ain't gonna go no, through just, that. I'm just, I'm just, <laughs> I'm, but shout out to that. I'm but, just saying. No, because I can out beat the niggas. Bitch. Oh, I can out You good. The, the, again? You, you can't say it, but <laughs> it's all good. <laughs> you been saying, like, I had already covered it. Here he come. You good. No, <laughs> she ain't. I can stand up there with them, though. Well, when I say challenges, I mean like 
have you ever been disrespected? Has somebody ever thought that you would trade services for, you know? Services. Oh, you mean that. They yeah, always she talk try, about they the M2, to... the Me Too version of the uh, <laughs> question. They always try. It's like, how you... I came here to work, bro. Like, I understand. Like, if I come there dressed up or something like that, okay, cool. Mm -hmm. But keep that over there. Especially if I, if I don't like you back neither, you just, I can't, can't keep coming to work here. And I they be still boomer. expecting to get paid for the session, homie. You Man, ain't going to get the out. cat and get paid. Wait, <laughs> wait, wait, wait. So, wait. They talk. They charge you. And they, they tell it. Oh, my Damn, God. I got to become an engineer. Like, oh, oh my bad. <laughs> No, don't put that out there. I'm lying. No, I'm, no, I'm, oh I'm, I'm, bull, I'm bull crapping right now. No. That is crazy. So for people who ain't in tune with you, where can they find you at on social media? Facebook, Armani K. My music page is Armani K. You can find me on Instagram and Twitter, Spaz versus Armani K underscore. Snapchat, L.Spaz. And my music is on SoundCloud and also on iTunes, you know, Google Play, all that. Title Apple Music everywhere. Yes, Go get it. Yes. Dream Team in the building. Armani K is here. We're going to take a quick break. We'll be right back. Perfect. You did. This your girl, Armani K, and you're listening to Urban Grind Radio. The Pluto, Stupo, you know. Tell me who fucking with my motherfucking team. Who up on that level? We got propellers and wings. Feel like I'm so way up. I can damn it to the sky. Ain't no coming down because I'm so flat. OrangeMixtapes.com Hey, what it do? This your boy OJ the Jew, man. I want to give a shout out to EarnMixtape.com. Yeah, what's happening, man? Scott ATL in the building. Shout out to OrangeMixtapes.com. OrangeMixtapes.com. Young World, what's poppin', man? It's Rocky Diamonds. OrangeMixtapes.com. Go get your latest mixtapes, man. Yeah. OrangeMixtapes.com. Now you might remember me from such country and western bands as the Gin Palace Jesters, or you might recall that for only 25 years I was the host of the Big C Jamboree in Chicago, Illinois, the longest running rockabilly jam session in the history of the world, thank you very much. I've spent the last 30 years or more of my life involved in the rockabilly scene in Chicago, to the point where some folks jokingly refer to me as the mayor of rockabilly. Well now, the mayor of Rockabilly has a brand new home. It is a program called Chicago Vintage. You can see brand new episodes every month right there on YouTube. And uh, we're going to be covering a lot of stuff. It's going to be it's going to be like the Tonight Show, but with uh, well, we're not going to have uh, Steve Martin and Rick Taylor as guests. Instead, we're going to have people who are involved in whether it's rockabilly music, swing dance music, country and western, um, hot rods, tattooing. Uh, jive dancing, swing dancing, whatever it is. Whatever is part of your life, if you're part of that vintage lifestyle that's been going on, well, ever since the 40s and 50s originally happened, all of your favorite Americana style rockabilly swing bands, you're going to see them live on stage. Plus, you have the opportunity, if you want, to come along to one of our live tapings that will be held once a month at a club in Berlin, Illinois called The Outer Space. A great club and uh, perilously close to my house. So come down for a taping or just be standing by right there on your YouTube, on your computer, on your smartphone, wherever you need it to be. We'll be there for you. Going down so deeply, a voice said to me. Hey, this is your girl Samantha Moon, and I would like you to go check out my new EP called Samantha Moon Wake Up Now on all social media platforms. And don't forget, check out my website at samanthamoonmusic.com. You call me now. You call me now. You call me now. When it's your turn, the table's turned, and now you're underwater.
fuck I'm forever high Heartbreak rebel on the level You can't verify Where I style on the beat and I'm on beast mode I'm on that I'm so damn high that I can't even speak bro Niggas wanna tweak cause they baby mama freak hoes But that's irrelevant and rebel ain't got time for that peasant shit I'm super fly Niggas mad put them in a pan box with a suit and tie Niggas won't beef, I supersize Ocean full of cash, I scuba dive Hoes come and go, they drop like dominoes Niggas straight out of comedy, you look so comical Niggas act till a full clip, make them find a road Turn into a murder scene with jazz So I spaz, yo All about the cash flow Higher than an ass row, bitch Tell me who fucking with my motherfucking team Who up on that level We got propellers and wings Feel like I'm so way up, I can damn near touch the sky I'm so flat, forever high, high. Why the Mickey Ray loop the arm? Cause I'm a big shot, like a three-pointer hoop in the harm. It's jazz, yo, no worries, I got y'all. The key to walking on water is knowing where the rocks are. Went for money and stepped it up, the pumpkins. The cold show, cold flow like Avion. Steel peeler, ring of bells like Le'Veon. Hood dreams, way beyond, way beyond. Memorize the game, deleted the files, defeated the odds, proceeded the guards, nigga, that's high. Plain is black and white, I'm seeing like you be dreaming off dial, metal trip to me. As I flip the scene, my shooters hard knock schoolers, toting them to the suspend you on principle. Non hospitable, unforgivable with the AK minerals flying up in your living room. What you mad at? Ape all the rat acts, yeah, master pumping crack acts, something to laugh at, get it on the first. Back and she a flirt, riding hoods, got more wolves, be alert. I'm up, yeah, up there, the cleverest, Everest, the Empire State, the Pluto, Stupo, you know. Tell me who fucking with my mother. Fucking team, who up on that level? We got propellers and wings. Feel like I'm so way up, I can damn near touch the sky. Ain't no coming down, cause I'm so flat forever. Ha, ha. Ain't no coming down, cause I'm so flat forever. Ha, ha. Ain't no coming down, cause I'm so flat forever. Ha, ha. Ain't no coming down, cause I'm so flat forever. Ha, ha. Ain't no coming down, cause I'm so flat forever. Put it aim at your brain like a chopper shooting game. Let your dame that a popper, you a change for a dollar, niggas lame, so I came for a thotter like I'm waiting on the collar, bringing the pain like I'm a saint within the bang with the opposite of watching with stepping them on my top of this coffee and novelist, flexing my dominance like I'm anonymous to honor. Politic out of this goblin shit, I'ma demolish it, doing the obvious out of your confidence, I'm on a bro smoking on the cushion, I'm off of the hood, high, looking down from the heavens, purple crown, all seven spin around, I'm a better in the stars, giving the weapon to come to the wild, shedding beast niggas down. Ain't no fucking with my team, the sun never had to bring my blood, the kings of real Madrid, the battle while higher beam, doing the unseen, walking in between, living in the balance of a triple beam. Digging the higher than the most, let them roast in the fire, earth win on the water surfing, and I'm working and searching for certain. You heard I be whipping in the clothes and the curves swerving like I'm in a hurry. Calling me the daddy when I put me on murder. That shit down, nigga, in the disturbing. Blood, nigga, now vision getting blurry. Step care. Tell me who fucking with my motherfucking team? Who up on that level? We got propellers and wings. Feel like I'm so way up, I can damn near touch the sky. Ain't no coming down, cause I'm so flat forever. Yo, it's the pride of the East Side DJ MH Tuttle. live at Smokey Studios on Urban Grind TV. And I'm here with this guy who's no stranger to the room. You've probably seen him all over Chicagoland and more, Mr. Bill Crane. How you doing, sir? Excellent. Nice to see you, sir. You as well. How you been? What you been up to? Uh, just very fortunate to be here. Thanks to Wally. So shout out to Wally, uh, Urban Grind TV. i uh, just been working, trying to uh, stay productive and relevant in 2019 every single day. I'm never taking a day off. I hear that. So what you doing to stay productive and relevant in 2019, sir? Well, uh, this evening I'll be with Van from Black Ink Crew Chicago. So my client, longtime client Van, will be uh, hosting an event. Last week he hosted my anniversary party, and uh, we happen to be celebrating 10,000 hashtag posts. So I only have 250 posts out there, and over 10,000 times people have used hashtag Raw Talent Shy, my company, I own Raw Talent Shy, and Grains World TV. So thanks to Wally for helping that process grow. 
love that. So what exactly is Raw Talent Chef for the people who don't know? So uh, a typical example is uh, like me, I'm a publicist. So I've gotten a li- 11 different clients on WGN Radio. So G Herbo, Bump J, Wyclef, uh, Cosign from the interns, uh, many others. I get people on TV, I produce uh, movies, um, May Fredo Santana, uh, Derek Coleman, Rest in Paradise. I was producing his movie Fredo Mafia. Um, I, I just, I try and always change it up. So that's it. So what are some of the things that we should look forward to from Raw Talent Shine 2019? I always keep people guessing because people get bored and stale of, you know, back in the day when I started, I would work with people from the 90s. And then I started working with people, you know, the younger generation like Gierbo and Famous Dex and Lil Bibby, all those great guys. And then people get bored of that. And then I started doing stuff with VH1, Black and Crew Chicago, and then people get bored of that. Then I started doing all the stuff with WGN and WGCI and the Jam TV show, so people get bored of that. So this year I plan on doing a lot of stuff with professional athletes and uh, doing some social media seminars. Um, as I've never invested one dollar into social media ever, all organic, all natural, hard work, seven days a week. So, if you could give uh, our viewers a tip on social media, what would you tell them to do? What would you tell them to start? Start. What you need to do is engage. So, people aren't going to come to your page unless you gravitate attention towards it. So, I would recommend liking, commenting, uh, dominate your city. Um, initially when I wanted to get my social media large I didn't care where my followers came from but the last three years I've only targeted Chicago so wherever I go people know who I am just because I probably like some of your photos and then you see uh, who I'm with and you're like oh my gosh I want to be with Gerbo February 8th at the Forge for exclusive Steve's birthday and LA is going to be performing so shout out to Big Meech for making that happen I love the plug I love the plug so um the Forge, uh, February 8th, G Herbo. What else besides the, uh, the shows that you got with artists that you're working on? What else can people expect from uh, production-wise from Raw Talent Show? Well, I've produced music videos, a couple for Famous Dex, a couple for King Louis, uh, 12 for Twista, uh, who rapped about me in a couple songs. So if it wasn't for Twista, uh, none of this would be possible. So. Um, the best of all time. So I started in 2013 uh, when I met him and then uh, met Bone Thugs and Harmony and then decided to start my own thing. And um, what you'll expect from me is uh, just to be always working, staying busy. I haven't missed a day of working out since July 7th. So I'm really going extremely hard and uh, all I care about is Chicago. Speaking of Chicago, what can what do you think we should expect entertainment wise in Chicago in 2019? Hopefully everybody unifies and uh, just wants to put out a good positive message um, and that's it. So I, I would recommend, uh, you know, more uh, more good energy, more positivity, um, you know, and like I mentioned, um, you know, before I was distracted. So let's ask me what you want most. Where can the people find you at on social media? I'm Cranes World TV. I own Raw Talent Shy, so at Cranes World TV, at Raw Talent Shy. Uh, hashtag Raw Talent Shy right now has 7,900 posts, and Cranes World TV has 2,430 posts. And once again, I've only posted, uh, I only have 250 posts out there. So a strong movement. And uh, thanks to Andrew Barbert, Fake Shore Drive, for also being some, uh, some inspiration for me as well, because he was really a trailblazer. And uh, really, um, you know, he's just a good man. Simple as that. DJ MH to the Brill Crane, Urban Grind TV, we out. Greetings in the finest of salutations. You're watching Urban Grind TV. This is Crane's World TV. I own Raw Talent Shy. Hey, what up, what up? Welcome back to Urban Grind TV. This is your girl, Joycey J. And who do we have with us today? Uh, I go by the name Ray Star. Okay, Ray Star, Ray Star. So let everyone know what you do. Uh, I pretty much rap. I do hip hop. Okay. So, what's your favorite types of genres within hip hop? Um, I don't know. I like. I think now I'm in some more some, the trap, trap vibe. But I like all type of hip hop. I like classic hip hop, '90s hip hop, '80s hip hop. I'm kind of in everything. Okay. So, what inspired you to rap? Actually, like as a as a kid, it's like you either hooping or you rapping. Or, you know, you're doing something like a sport. So um, that was just my thing. As a kid, I always wanted to rap. 
it was like my way to get everybody out the hood. So. Okay, okay. And uh, did you let everybody know where you from? Well, I'm from Chicago. I uh, lived in Champaign for a couple of years. Right now, I reside in Indiana. Okay, Indiana, Indiana. Well, thank you. Thank you for coming to the Urban Grind TV. And let everybody know where they can find you at on all social media platforms. Well, thank you all for having me. Uh, you can find me on Instagram at RayBands, RayBands, 4Zs. You can find me on Twitter at Everybody Loves Ray, E-R-R-R, -R -R, Body Loves Ray. Hey, y'all heard it here from Urban Grind TV. We out. I go by the name of Ray Star, and you tuned in to Urban Grind TV. Yes, sir.